Yo, what's up? It's your boy Currency365. Hope you guys are doing well. Legends never die. They stay in our hearts. Uh, if you want to support us, click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and also you can come down here and hit the join button uh, under the video uh, or in our channel uh, section. And you can also join our Patreon, patreon.com slash currency365. And uh, we also have Cash App and also PayPal uh, for support if you want to sell some seeds. Peace out. God bless. Enjoy the video and keep the movement going. Legends. Bye. All right, all right. Welcome back to Currency 365. Hope you guys are doing well. It is September 9th, 2024. Lung Community, USTC, and Luna 2.0 Community. What is going on, everybody? Hope you guys had a great weekend. And now we're it was packed with football games, right? So you got oh, football overload, right? So everywhere you turn is football commercials, football games, football highlights, football, everything football, right? Um, and uh, so college football on Saturday, then NFL was yesterday, and NFL again today. Uh, for Monday night, San Francisco versus uh, the Green Bay Packers tonight. So, I mean, the Jets, excuse me, the Jets. Uh, I was thinking about Aaron Rodgers. Yeah. But anyway, it's the New York Jets versus the, the 49ers tonight. So, it's, it's just crazy, man. But anyways, um, I hope all is well. And um, you can see that the markets are going up. So, that's a good sign, right? So, up 4% today. Um, you know, and if you guys follow me on Patreon, you know that we talked about on Patreon that when we're about 10 days out, we're going to see the, the, we, we might see the, 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 you know, multimillionaires and billionaires start to buy Bitcoin. Right. And, and so that they're, they're, you know, I, I put out a, a statement about that on Patreon and how they were, they were probably going to flush a retail out down to about 52, 50,000 area. And then they're probably going to, with 10 days, nine, nine, 10 days left, they're probably going to then buy, start buying Bitcoin uh, and then run it up into the into the rate cut decision, the historic rate cut decision, which is now 100%. Uh, Wall Street predicts 100% that the feds are going to indeed cut rates, right? And most likely it's gonna be a 0.25% basis to start it off. And yeah, the markets are going to price that in, and uh, it looks like the crypto markets are pricing that in as well. And then it's probably going to be a sell the news event once the rate cut decision is made, right? So, so that's what's happening right now. Of course, anything can change at any moment, right? So, um, but right now it will run. Things are being. Uh, Shorts are being liquidated right now as Bitcoin starts to run up, and that's causing short squeezes to the upside. And um, so we'll see how this all plays out. All right. So right now, Luna Classics taking advantage of that up 7% today. Um, you know, that's good for us. You know, anybody that's holding five, you know, five, six figures, seven figures in this thing, that's really good. 7% this is really good, right? So it really is getting, get, trying to get us back on track, right? You know, so that's a nice, that's a nice amount when you're holding five, six, seven figures in an investment, right? You, when it's up 7% in one day, that's pretty good. All right. 466 um, million market cap. We've got 12 million in volume. Volume is really low here. Uh, only 12 million in volume. This is bear market volume. It's crazy. Um, 5.7 uh, trillion in uh, circulating supply. And, and Happy Caddy Crypto has been pushing heavily um, that we got a lot of USTC and, and Luna um, classic that we can burn. You know what I mean? So um, if you've been watching his videos, he's showing evidence that TFL is going to be burning a lot. And plus the um, uh, other other wallets that they that, that, that are out there. The, the um the bridge wallet the lfg wallet or whatever it's called um and then the other the other things that they have it could be a lot of burns here for for ustc and luna classic so it's exciting times and um and yeah we're ready for it man we're ready to see this thing burn can you imagine another billion off of this down to 4.8 and it's like wow the confidence the community is going to have when we're under five billion tokens for a USTC is going to be crazy. I'm going to, I'm definitely, my confidence level is going to go through the freaking roof. I'm going to be like, I know we can get down. I know we can do this now, right? So, you know, I've already said we can do it, but when we get down, when we get under five, I definitely know we can do it. 
right? So we're at 5.8 billion. When we when we're under five, there's no doubt in my mind we can get to one billion and and get this thing up to freaking 80, 90 cents and and repeg this thing and get lunk into the pennies and dollars. It's just gonna be it's just gonna be how bad do we want to how fast do we want to do it. Because it's going to be guaranteed at that point, you know, to go from four to one billion because we're burning every day. But how fast do we want to do it? Do we want to do it in 2025? Do we want to do it here in 2024? Do we want to do it in 2026? Right. So it'll just be how fast do you want to get down to one billion. Right. So um, and it's illogical to get down to one billion because who has who holds those tokens to get us to one billion. Right. So. Uh, and can those tokens be moved or or can those tokens be burned or whatever, you know what I mean? So we don't know. Okay, so let's go over to here. We are up 5%. So Lunk's outpacing USTC today. So interesting. But USTC volume's at 5 million. So, okay. And then here's Luna 2.0 and it's, it's still under 35 cents. So this thing, you know, is still really cheap here, you know? Uh, and it's 240 million on market cap, 19 million in volume. And then... um. It's kind of interesting that this does more volume than Lunk, and this has and Lunk has a massive bigger community, so that's really weird. Um, that's what I'm saying. Lunk's volume is way off. You know what I mean? In my opinion, um, 692 uh, million in circulating supply there. Yeah, something's wrong with Lunk's volume. I, I, don't, I don't. I there's no way Terra Two is doing more volume than Lunk. You know what I mean? I mean, Lunk has a massive community. You know, so I don't know. Anyways um kind of weird okay um let's go to uh let's go to galaxy station because there's a bunch of new proposals okay so look at this we haven't seen proposals like this in a long time the proposal board used to be the last six months has been one lucky if there's two right so, <laughs> but now we have um now we have uh hold on one second i'm, I'm on margex as well so Gotta check my my mark my account here. All right, Bitcoin's Bitcoin's doing well. Fifty six thousand nine hundred uh, fifty six on Bitcoin. I got one order up ninety three bucks ninety four bucks right now. So um, yeah, so yeah, I got long. I'm you know got a lot a lot of long positions here. Long on XRP now. Long on Bitcoin to the upside. And, uh, we'll see how it plays out. You know what I mean? I've been long though. These some of these orders have been in there for almost like five days. So I've just been chilling. Is waiting for the reversal so anyways all right so here is um the proposals some of them we already know about the maximum and uh we only we have uh 21 hours left on this one and right now it's not going to reach a um threshold unless somebody unless somebody big changes that right so this might not reach a threshold now why what what incentive does the top 10 validators have to vote yes on this or abstain or anything. It, I mean, it's not reaching a threshold right now. So they, the top five validators or, or top 10 validators that haven't voted yet, if they vote, it reaches a threshold. Like, you know, the ones that haven't voted yet. So what incentive would, would they get to do this? I mean, 10 more people for competition, 10 more people to take your rewards away from you. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't, I don't know. You know, I don't know. So this is going to be interesting to see if this one actually reaches a threshold. Because if I was a val, if I was a top ten val, I, I, why would I want competition? Uh, more competition. I got a hundred people to deal with. Or I got ninety nine other validators to deal with. Now I got now I'm going to add another ten. So that's just my mindset. But you know, if the community wants it done, it's going to get done. We got twenty one hours to get this done. So we'll see if that gets done or not. Um, this one still has three days, so this one's failing right now. The, the signal proposal, creation of a collateral pool. Okay. Now, I, I, we don't know anything about it, and then maybe that's why it's failing, right? They had added, like, give us some stuff about it. I guess it's on the Commonwealth, but you, this is a proposal, signal proposal, so you got to put it on here as well and at least give us an idea of what you're talking about. Now, you, you know, if you're talking about what I said, the collateral for a repack, that's different, right? Um, but anyways, that's not passing. This is not passing as well. We don't have to go over that. You guys already see it for yourselves. Then we got three new ones here, including a big one here, right? So we'll go over these two first. Um, integrated um, rule set for secure and inclusive uh, Terra Luna Classic uh, L1 development, and that's not going to pass. And people don't want to. People don't want rule sets. <laughs> people are like we have enough rules. 
Oh, Bitcoin, 57,000. Just crossed over 57,000. All right. Bitcoin just crossed over 57,000 here. All right. So I'm trying to, you know, can, can Bitcoin get back to 60,000? And uh, maybe maybe it's going to launch up to 60,000 and then rest there, right, for a couple of days and then try to get up to about 68,000. Or is it going to go to 60,000, rest there, and then crash back down? <laughs> you know, who knows, right? Uh, I guess we're going to wait, wait and see. Uh, improved sec um, security solutions framework for L1 development. Uh, not sure that one's going to pass either. That's going to be up in the air. That's going to be an iffy one. And then this one's definitely going to pass. Uh, upgrade to V3.1.5. Okay. So, and this is all about the tax to gas. Uh, the Genuine Labs tax to gas is completed and they're about to implement it. And so if, if Christopher needs to be watching this because once this passes then he needs to be going ahead immediately with the 1.5 percent burn tax right and uh so we'll see how that plays out so okay so let's see how this one plays out that one should pass with with, with no with no problems here uh okay so they they went back they retested everything that the community had concerns about they completed they went to rebel station tested it there seems like everything's working fine so it's good to go all right, so let's finish up here. Uh, 24 million in burns today, all right? And uh, and a 9,000 in burns today for USTC. 15.37 staking ratio there. Oracle pool headed towards that 100 billion. We'll watch and see how that plays out. And then the community pool headed to that 7 billion and 13 million there. And then stats, we lost 792. Every time that we pump a little bit, people get excited and unstaked. Oh, is this it? This is it? This is it? September, we're we're about to we're about to go to um, you know, about to go to three zeros uh five, you know what I mean? And so uh, hopefully we do, right? If we do, then we do. That's gonna be awesome. Um, but anyways, uh, remember you have to wait 21 days, so if we get the if we get the three zeros five, we're gonna do it before the eighteenth. You have to wait twenty one days. You're too late. <laughs> you know. <laughs> so if we're gonna go to three zeros five, we're gonna do it right now. We're gonna do it. With, you know what I mean? We're just gonna literally launch, right? And it's gonna happen between now and the eighteenth, right? Of the rate cut. So, uh, yeah. But I guess you know it is what it is. Um. Okay, so uh, here's people burning uh, lunks. Shout out to everybody that's burning lunk uh, today. Nice. And uh, FR, is that Frag Ecosystem? Did he change his name? <laughs> I, don't know, I, don't, I don't know. FRG Ecosystem. I don't know who that is. Uh, 1.2 billion. Okay, nice. And then 0% uh, zero percent uh, fee and USDC airdrops lost almost a billion. Wow. So I don't know what's up with that. Anyways, let's go here uh, to miss signatures. KK Validator, 4,601, 4, or in 10, actually. Uh, node uh, stake lost, uh, uh, missed 1,099. Wow. Okay, so we had 38 validators miss signatures today. Wow. Okay. Uh, that's not looking good there. We're, we're, we're back to missing signatures again. Anybody? No, nobody jailed, though. Okay. So let's wrap it up here. Look, we got the top 10 validators here, and none of them are missing signatures. Look at that. Last 30 days, clean as a whistle. The highest is 21. That's nothing, right? So good. You know, the top 10 are doing what they're supposed to do. They're representing not missing signatures. People are getting the rewards, and so nothing to complain about there. All right. So top 10 looking good. Salute. And then, and then once you get into here, it starts to get a little bit choppy. <laughs> you know, look at them you know, in the thousands and stuff. But top 10 is... Top 10 is doing a thing. And that's how, that's how it should be in the top 10. When you're in the top 10, you should be squeaky clean. You know what I mean? All right. Um, that's it. Peace out. God bless. Hope you guys are doing well. Shout out to the validators that are securing the blockchain for us. Even the bad ones, you know, that at least they're securing the blockchain for now. Right. And then we'll, you know, they got their own agendas and we'll, we'll see it in the bull cycle. You know, most of these validators are not going to show you their true colors until we get into the bull cycle. And then we will start to see their true colors. We're going to hacks are going to, you know, we're going to see some hacking. We're going to see some, so potential hacking and all types of stuff, right? It's going to be crazy because the greed is going to be out of control, right? So, because now we're playing with hundred million to billions of dollars on the line now, right? So, and um, yeah, anyways, peace out. God bless. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.